welcome or welcome back. My name is Sophie and I'm Canadian cash stuffer and zero based budgeter. And today we're going to be stuffing $580 into our cash envelopes and sinking funds. Before we even get started, I want to thank you guys so, so much for the sweet comments and the support on me possibly losing my job. I did want to give a little bit of an update on that before we get started. So it's not as certain as it was. I think my boss spoke too soon. Um, she probably shouldn't have had that conversation with me, but I do think that I won't be losing it in April, maybe just a little bit later. So that helps out financially a lot, obviously, to not be losing my job in four months. So I'm not, <laughs> nothing's guaranteed, but I so appreciate the support and like the positive comments that you guys left me and everything you guys are just the best so thank you so much also we did reach 500 subscribers which I am in disbelief about because when I think of the amount of subscribers I have I usually picture like an amphitheater or like a classroom and 500 people is a lot and I just want to say, say thank you for that as well so that being said, let's get started with today's video. We are going to begin with our cash envelopes. So Archie and Winnie are getting $160, which is like their typical amount um, that I like to stuff for them. But I don't always do that because financially sometimes we just can't do it. But this week we are doing that. My envelope is getting 75. My denominations might be strange today because I forgot a denomination card at home. And so I kind of had to go by instinct and just trust that I was getting out the right bills. But really, I'm super unsure if I did it correctly. I don't think I did. So um, yeah, groceries we already stuffed because I went to the bank and then I went straight to do like our last minute grocery for Christmas. It wasn't as bad as I was expecting, but there were ingredients that were already sold out. So I don't know what I'm gonna do about that. We still have to go back just to see if we can find it. Christmas time can be very stressful, but I'm trying to this year really enjoy that stress and like pause and take a breather and realize that like this is good stress because it's going to end up into something that I really love, which is spending time with my family, eating a lot of food and, you know, sometimes opening presents, but I just, the stress kind of gets to you sometimes. So anyway, in grocery, we still have $165 left because it was just like a small grocery. We had a lot of what we already needed. Plus um, me and my family, like on my mom's side, we kind of split what everything costs. Like we don't, not one person buys everything. So we split the cost and the food and all of that. So we're gonna put this back into our wallet and then we will dump our coins into a, our coins jar. We have a lot this week. When our small business is busy, we usually have a lot of coins because we shop a lot with cash for our small business. There we go. Also, if you see like dirt on my sleeves, Winnie, our dog, is officially a digger and she's been digging past the snow into the mud and coming into the house and making everything dirty including us so that's been pleasant <laughs> um it's been really annoying actually like i just i thought she would like grow out of it or stop doing that but she has not so we're really dealing with that right now um because she loves going outside and we're not watching her for 30 minutes you know like we come back inside so i don't know anyways emergency will be getting 20 dollars this week we're finally starting to put a little bit more in here trying to get this to about two thousand dollars so we now have one two twenty forty forty five fifty fifty five sixty so two sixty we used to put only five dollars every week so um i just knew that that wasn't enough Medical is getting 55. Vet bills is getting 40. 
Winnie had her spay. It went really well. She was sad for a couple of days, but she is back to normal now. She's not supposed to be like fully active yet, but it's really hard to keep a puppy like sleeping for 24 hours. So she is back to her hyper self and I'm just hoping that she doesn't bust her stitches, but they look, it, the incision looks really, really good. So that went really, really well. Vet Bills now has 1, 2, 3, 354, 20, 40, 45, 50, 55. So 455. It costs more than that because we decided to put a microchip in her. Um, so it's not quite covering the cost, but close enough that I don't, I won't feel bad about trying to pay this off. Like it won't make me struggle that much. Home maintenance is getting $20. Oops. <laughs> Car maintenance is getting $10. Me and my husband are going to see a World Juniors game this afternoon, which is super exciting. Um, he got tickets for free, like from his workplace. I don't love hockey. I don't really get into sports that much, but I love the food. <laughs> so we're going around dinner time. So that will be nice. Uh, car maintenance is getting, oh, did I add that 10? I don't know if I did. Did I add $10 in here, guys? I have no idea. Let's just count it. If we have $10 left at the end, we'll come back. So it now has 1, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 2, 205. I have no idea if I added that 10. No idea. Baby fund will be getting $5. It now has 1, 2, 3, 320, 325. I didn't do a budget with me this week. Um, not everybody loves them, and I just didn't have time. It's Christmas. It's busy. Everybody is in the same situation. So I know you guys will understand. Subscriptions will be getting 10. It now has 20, 20, 40, 60, 80, 91, 5, 10, 15. So 115. And that is exactly what we need for Amazon, which has come out at this point. So that's awesome. Debt is getting 50. It now has 51, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 2, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 3, 305, 310. So the reason there's so many small bills in here is that I do use my debt envelope as like money to exchange bills or for change sometimes. So that's why we're going to move on to our low priority sinking funds now. Okay. So vacation is getting $5. Vacation. Yep. Yeah. It now has 20. Christmas is getting 25. I definitely owe myself in here. It's just been, I've just gone over budget with like random things. Like I, we, um, we do crackers every year and me and my husband are responsible for buying crackers. Well, like I completely forgot to budget for crackers. So not like crackers that you eat, like those crackers that you pull. Um, so yeah, I'm above our budget, but I'm just going to keep putting as much as I can in here and paying myself back. Speaking of Christmas though, I'd love to know what your traditions are every year and what you do for Christmas. Um, I think my family and I do way too much and I just, I'm super curious to know what other people do. Are we the minority or does everyone feel like they have something for every single meal for like five days straight? I don't know. <laughs> Let me know. Gifts is not getting anything, but it has 40 in there. My husband is getting 20. I like to put 20, but I can't always put 20. So when I can, I do it. He now has 50, 70, 90, 110, 130, 35, 40. So 140 in there, which is awesome. I don't know what he has as a plan for this, but 140 is a great amount. Future home is getting $5. 
It now has one, two, 20, 40, 45, 50. My sister's wedding is getting 75. 40, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75. And miscellaneous is getting five. It now has 10. And that is it, you guys. Thank you so, so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please give it a like. Please subscribe to the channel if you wish. And definitely leave a comment. I read and answer all of you guys' comments and I love them. With all of that being said, Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, Happy New Year. I don't know. Actually, no. I'll have a video up before New Year. But... I think. Maybe not. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Happy New Year. I hope you guys have an amazing time with family and friends and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!